Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Andrea and if you're new here, welcome. For today's video, we are going to be doing my everyday makeup look. It takes no longer than 10 to 15 minutes and this is basically how you're going to see my face looking every single day. Unless I have a special occasion or I'm going out somewhere that requires eyeshadow, 9 out of 10 times I am not wearing any eyeshadow whatsoever and this is how my face looks and I did get a couple of requests um, for this makeup look on my video comparing the two Revlon brushes that's been my most popular video so far and I've had a couple of requests for the makeup I was wearing that day which is my everyday makeup routine now I can't believe I haven't done an everyday makeup routine in years I mean the last one was one of my first videos and then after that I did like a 10 minute mommy makeup look so it was definitely time to do an updated everyday makeup look and this is it right here so if you're interested to see how I achieve my everyday makeup look in 15 minutes or less and just keep on watching hey guys so the first thing we're gonna do is prime the face and I always go in with the rare beauty illuminating primer I just think it's a wonderful primer and I love it so let's go ahead and apply that to the face and the next thing I'm gonna do is spray a little bit of the always an optimist um spray from Selena Gomez as well that was uh that was something the next thing I'm going to do is apply foundation and for my everyday makeup I usually go with the Maybelline Fit Me in the Matte and Poreless and I absolutely adore this foundation and when it is an everyday makeup I do tend to use a drugstore foundation and then if I'm going to go out or any special occasions, any pictures or anything like that then I'll dip into the Rare Beauty foundation just because it's a little more expensive and I do want to get a lot of use out of that. So I'm just going to apply some of the Fit Me foundation and blend it out. Once the foundation is nice and blended, I'm going to jump into concealer and for that I'll be using the Rare Beauty um, concealer now I do have a drugstore concealer but this is everything I love this concealer a lot so this is usually what I dip into Okay, next I'm going to set the concealer and I am going to go with the Fit Me powder. I usually use the air spun, but ever since I got this, I have not been able to put it down. So, this one it is. And then I also use this to set the eyelid. The next step in my routine is to do the eyebrows and I always go in with the L'Oreal Brow Stylist in the shade Brunette. I swear, this is the part that takes the longest. Ten years later. Just thought of that Spongebob meme. <laughs> anyway. So once the eyebrows are on, I go ahead and I set them and I use the e.l.f. Wow Brow in the shade Brunette as well. Once the eyebrows are done, the rest is super easy. We're going to go in with the Butter Bronzer and we're going to bronze up the face. Then for blush, I'm going to go in with Milani Luminoso. This is my all-time favorite blush. It's just so, so beautiful. Next for highlight, my all-time favorite highlight, and the one I mostly use every day is ColourPop Flexitarian. You guys already know this is my favorite highlighter ever. Ever. 
And then I grab a little more of the Flexitarian and then I like to highlight my brow bone and inner corner. I just feel like that ties the whole makeup look together without really trying because we don't use any eyeshadow. But you still have a little pop in the eye. After that, I do grab a little spoolie and I like to brush out my eyelash extensions. And then we're going to move on to the lips. And my favorite lip liner is MAC Sora. I don't know how old this is, but this is my everyday go-to shade. I just feel like it's the perfect shade for my skin and for my lips. And then I do like to add like a mauve kind of lipstick, a pinky nude. And today we're going to go with the Rare Beauty. And I'm pretty sure this is what I was using in my Revlon brush comparison video. And I had a couple of people ask me to recreate that makeup look. So that's why I wanted to use this lip combo because this is basically the makeup look I was wearing on that video. I feel like this lipstick is the perfect match for the sore. Um, lip liner. The last step, of course, is to set your makeup look, and for that, I'm going to be using the Rare Beauty once again. And that is it. Literally not even 15 minutes. This is my everyday makeup look. And yeah, guys, once you set your makeup look, you are ready for the day. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy it. And make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Make sure you turn that little bell on so you never miss any of my videos. Leave me some suggestions for future videos. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Hey, guys. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing I'm going to do is this... So the first thing I'm going to do is Hey guys Hey guys, so the first thing I do is prime my face and I usually end up going for the rare beauty um always This is not always not The butter butter With 